Mr. Ramsey. Good morning. How are you doing? How are you? Mark Westgar. Welcome Mark. to Brixton. Thank you. Um, OK. Um, you've handed all your personal items into the gate there? Uh, yeah, phone and... Your phone uh, and everything like yeah, that. Can I remind you to do that every day that you come? Certainly, of OK. Course. Let's that go works. inside. Officer Mark Westgarth is taking me into the heart of the prison. Here, the prisoners are kept in their cells up to 21 hours a day. I mean, if he tries to mug me off, I'll put him right in his place. I'm not about that. No problem. I'm not here to be made fun of by him or anyone else. A lot of these people believe that they're going to do this and their lives will dramatically change. Get them back. Hey, hey. What do I think about Ramsey? He can be a bit fierce with people that he's working with. Yeah, that's what I think about <laughs> I think he would lose a few people along the way. That's how it goes, you know, only the strong survive. Hey, on, what's going on? Hey, what's going on? The prisoners are housed in five separate wings. I have no idea who I'm going to be working with. If he's come here to change the world, I don't think he will. And I don't think long term it's going to, going to be a winner. And how many uh, prisoners are in here? Uh, I believe it's 220 others. Wow. Ninety percent of the criminals on this wing have serious drug or alcohol problems. Oh, they'll go to the kitchen and sort it out, yeah? Uh, it's fucking bullshit down there, mate. Boy, oh. <laughs> you look just like you look on TV. <laughs> and you look better with the other two feet. Thank you. Have you got one in the middle coming? No, no, that's just my gap. That's, that, yeah, that's my selling point. That's what I'm for, though. Can you cook? Of course I can cook. What was the last thing you cooked? Last thing I cooked was last thing I cooked. Last thing I cooked was paella. Paella? Yeah, paella. I could cook paella. I could cook, um Mean lasagna. Mean lasagna. lasagna. Mr. Abram, how are you, sir? No, mate. He's working with Jamie Oliver. <laughs> <laughs> Toes unlocked! It's lunchtime. The prisoners are let out of their cell for a few brief moments to collect their food. It's a chance for me to go face to face with some of my potential workers. Um, obviously, you signed up. Yeah. yeah. Um, can you cook? Yeah. Have you got a party going on with all that bread? <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Kelly, uh, so you signed up? Yeah, I'm Are you king to learn? Yeah. Good. Can What's you that? cook? No, I can't cook. I'll try it. I'll have a go. Can you find egg? Yeah, yeah, of course you can. Can you poach an egg? Basic. Yeah. Not really. Can you scramble egg? Yeah. Good. I'll have a go. Mr Jones. When was the last time you cooked? Tonight. Um, well, seven months ago now. What was it? Uh, spaghetti bolognese. Spaghetti bolognese. Did it go down well? Oh, yeah. Well, no, Good right man. Down. It's easy to forget. Some of these prisoners are here for serious offences. How long are you in for? Four years. Four years for doing what? Oh, well, they found a shotgun under your bed. They found a shotgun under your bed. Some of these people are quite dangerous. You may get people screaming and shouting at you because you're, you know, you're famous. So they might, they might want to have a pop. Please don't rise to it. No, no, no. We'll, no we'll, we'll deal with it. Yeah, you know what I mean? That's, that's yeah, definitely. We're, we're good at it. No. The mood has suddenly turned, and an offender is kicking off. All I can hear is my name. It's amazing how quick it kicks off like that, all of a sudden, bang, in a heartbeat. One minute is silent, next minute. Like a potential riot. These are men under pressure. And when men are under pressure, they can do so bad things. things. What kind of things can happen to them? What were they? An argument, a fight, uh, throwing something? Could or... be anything. Anything. Could be anything. Tough job, Tony. The enormity of what I've taken on is starting to sink in. In 2010, there were over 14,000 assaults in prison and nearly 3,000 attacks on staff. Recently, someone got their throat slit. Just 
Guy jumped up behind, toothbrush, melted in and slipped. Um, that's the kind of things that go on. You can feel it, there's like a sort of... It's a huge weight of pressure in here, almost like it's bursting. It's so intense. Didn't seem it at first. For every hour I'm here, it's just getting stronger and stronger and stronger.